Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. The wait is over. This is your favorite prophetess, Prophetess Chanel Jones, and I want to introduce to you my new non-traditional podcast called Kingdom Women Speaking, where you can expect a royal discussion amongst queens. Yes, Lord. And you can find me on New Orleans Talk Network. <laughs> Tune in, world. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to another powerful episode of Kingdom Women Speaking. I have one of my favorite hosts, Evangelist Cornette, in the Hello. building today. I told you guys, watch out. This woman of God has some liquid gold for you powerful and you can mold it you can shape it to your individual life you know we've been talking about uh mind control control. for like an entire month and we've been really focusing on uh meditation we taught you guys how to meditate what what it is to meditate and this episode we're going to tell you the benefits of meditation you can re uh write your brain based on your thoughts you know i was watching this video on youtube where it had this guy who learned how to drive without arms Mm -hmm. And there was another lady who learned how to drive without legs. You know, they learned to do that despite their advantages. You can learn to do whatever you want to do. It's all in the mind. And we trying to help you how to meditate. And we got some key things because it's all based on what you believe. So I want to give you these key tips and we're going to expound. We're going to break it down. The woman of God have some excellent ideas, excuse me, ideas and advantages for you to do what meditation but we're going to go over these quick tips and then we're going to expound on them but remember this when you pray you you're you're praying to god God. but when you meditate you're talking to the god within that's another level that's another level you go within yourself you know you go to revealing yourself so the tip number one the benefits on how to meditate these are the benefits of meditation um the first thing it will slow down your thoughts and make you more aware of addictive behavior. That's powerful. Also, it will improve your memory. It will cleanse your mind of competitive thoughts and help you concentrate. That's one thing that we have to do is learn how to concentrate even as an adult. Another thing, it was it will unsteal unshakable self it will instill unshakable self confidence. We all need that. And in as well as inner strength and your faith in the higher power another thing a benefit of meditation with this your self assurance will soar enabling you to decide how your future will be we all want a better future and we all want to live better so yes. meditation will help us have a better future and help us to um live better it it will also be useful in getting rid of some of unnecessary heart baggage. We all have that, and giving you the strength to get your thoughts uh, through a trying day. I had a trying day yesterday as a supervisor. Oh my God! And meditation was one of the things that helped me to get through that trying day. It's the key. It is most definitely the key. Uh, meditation has the power to invoke enlightenment as well as a greater awareness of conscious and of the spiritual world. That's one thing that most people don't understand, that the spiritual world is constantly um, evolving just like the natural world yes. is, is the same. It helps you to overcome your fears, relax your body, and restore your energy. Yes, Lord. We all need that. Yes. Um, and another thing, uh, a benefit of meditation, your nervous system will quiet down and you will have more control over your senses. You will have more control. And this is one of my favorite. It assists you in developing awareness and uh, improving your communication skills. And this is one thing that truly helped me. I feel as if I have elite communication skills. You know, I by meditate, it calms, like I say, it calms your nervous system down where you can focus. And when you can focus, you see clear. And when you see clear, you can articulate more clear because all you're doing is articulating what you see and what you think. And if your mind is clearer, you can speak more clear. So that's one of the benefits that uh, meditation has really done for me. My communication skills. Yes. You know, yes, it, 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 does. It, it does. You know, you can yes. communicate With better. Any individual. Any individual. Matter. 
it, and it actually it once again when I say it, it relaxes you and take the fear it takes the fear away where you can speak directly to anyone yes you know and a lot of people are so used to indirect communication you know for us and talking with slangs and side talking sneak disses when someone come with clear um, communication they deem that as aggressive because right. they don't know how to handle yes. somebody that's direct you know um, and honestly uh, meditation will put you in that realm where you can have clear communication now you're going to have some backlash because people are not used to that but that's right. one of the benefits of meditation you can have elite communication skills and one of the, and, uh, and once you learn to meditate you can enter in at any time you yes. can enter in at any time. So these are the, some of the benefits that we. This show is going to be about. We're gonna don't worry about it. We know we gave you a lot. It was a lot, but we're gonna expound on each one of these steps when we come back with Evangelist Kernet Jones. What do you are watching? Kingdom Women speaking and come back. We're gonna break it down. I know we gave you a lot. We gave you a lot of meat. But we're going to cut that meat down for very, you. Very, very <laughs> yeah. it's very Health, healthy for you. Yes, yes. Healthy for you, you know, for your mind, body, and soul. Yes. I told you this woman of God has some liquid gold, and we're going to get into that liquid gold when we come back with Kingdom Women Speaking. Yes, Lord. Amen. Yes, Lord. <laughs> yes. yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes Lord, yes Lord, yes Lord, yes, yes Lord, 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 yes Listen up, your customers, our listeners could be hearing about your business right now, yeah, right now. Don't miss out on the opportunity to advertise with NewOrleansTalkNetwork.com. Call our business department today at 504-475-4793 to hear about our great rates. NewOrleansTalkNetwork.com. We provide the people, you provide the business. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. The wait is over. This is your favorite prophetess, Prophetess Chanel Jones, and I want to introduce to you my new non-traditional podcast called Kingdom Women Speaking, where you can expect a royal discussion amongst queens. Yes, Lord. And you can find me on New Orleans Talk Network. <laughs> Tune in, world. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome back. back. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to Kingdom Women Speaking. And you already know the co-host. Hello. Uh, you already know her, Connect Jones. And we was talking about, before we left, we gave you some powerful liquid gold. You know, some benefits on how on meditation. But now, we're going to break it down. Because we know we gave you a lot. And like the first thing we spoke about, it it will slow down your thoughts and make you more aware of any addictive behaviors. Any, any addictive behavior. Any behavior that is i can really say it helps you with bad habits right wow, good yes, job it good helps job you with bad habits and it, it makes you more aware mm. of your bad habits right and then once you learn how to meditate you know it's it is levels you have to come in sometime you got to fight different thoughts and once you get to that agape a uh, level of meditation then the holy spirit um really takes over and it really show you things now sometimes when you meditate when you're first learning how to meditate you may be thinking about all type of oh, different yeah, yeah. random all things kind of like and that's work. why the whole episode the whole series is about mind control you know it takes you to different steps of meditation you know the um the data the beta and um the uh 
think it's alpha mm -hmm. that you go in for is an alpha is when God takes over mm -hmm. and give you vision and show you different things. So meditation, it, once again, it helps you to um, absorb and see the addictive behaviors. Yes, it does. And um, for as an uh, and God and honestly, it once God show it to you is a is a choice on if you choose to follow that and another thing it improves your memory yes it does and so like in the bible said the holy spirit will bring back to your memory everything that he talks so like you once you go into meditation you know god said he will keep them in perfect peace whose mind say them and once you get into that peace of mind and once you get still the holy spirit will then talk to you like we've been saying this for a very long time that the holy spirit talks in a soft still voice and so once again it'll help you to clean your mind of complete Repeating thoughts, and that's why I say when you first come into meditation, you have having all type of thoughts, you know. Like, but right. it helps you to clean all those thoughts to the side and help you to stay focused. And you, you know, would, you would have to want this. Yes, it's got to be a desire. Ooh. This is what you want. Well, once again, you can learn how to do anything. Just like the people that, despite their disadvantages, when we first came on, you know, with a guy learning how to drive a, a car without um, legs, right. and that uh, the lady without arms, they still learn to drive. The Despite the disadvantages because it's all in the mind you gotta want yes, to right. learn how to do it and once you want to learn how to do it this liquid gold that this woman of god is giving you gonna, yes, push, it's gonna you. push you it's like go, it's, you know what it's gonna be do more than push you. it's gonna be like a wave of water just pushing you to the other yes, side you're gonna be running to it <laughs> yes you, you know to it. <laughs> right because you watch yes the, watch the benefits of it you know prove me to be wrong Try it out for yourself. You can't. Try you it. can't lose. You Try you it. won't lose anything oh, by just I was by such a mess. <laughs> you know because it's you have nothing to gain. Nothing. Oh, you, you know you have. I'm sorry. You have. You nothing, have more, nothing to lose. Nothing you have to lose. Everything right, to, to gain. gain. You have right. everything to gain. Excuse my dyslexia oh, yeah, for a we, second. Yes. <laughs> We're trying to try it. You know. Yeah, yeah. You know, <laughs> trying to get all this stuff out. You know, but test test it out. And if I'm wrong. I owe you a meal. <laughs> but once it, it helps you to concentrate. Yes, it does. And and when you concentrate, you know, once again, this stuff is all in your mind. It makes it easier to believe the uh, the thoughts that God has given to you because God has a plan for your life. Yes, he does. And so in order for God to, for God plan to be active in your life, you know, you have to first concentrate. You have to get those competitive thoughts that Satan is trying to give to you out. You know, so whatever you, whatever thought that you believe the most is what you going to act on mm -hmm. you know because it'll be your primary thought like the bible says, as a man thinking his heart so is he mm -hmm. so your primary thought is what you're gonna be as a person you know and another one it was still unshakable confidence baby i'm living witness of this oh yes yeah, she is <laughs> Yes, she is. But when I say unshakable, babe, I had yes. forty five people coming against me yesterday, and I know you was ready for all, babe. I, I sat in that chair, and, and one girl say, "I'm a stand on what I say," and I said, "Well, I'm gonna be seated because a, a queen is seated. Oh yeah, I'm seated you on the throne, leg. baby. I'm legs. seated on the right hand of God. Okay, yes, I'm, I'm seated with Him. That's right. You know? oh, yeah. <laughs> I sit." At gotta, the table, I ain't standing at no table that God bold. prepared for me. I'm, yes. I'm, I'm seated at the table. You gotta be God. bold in Christ, you know. And so, and and then, and so, I just, I say, you know what? I told those girls. I say your complaints and your thoughts are not going on deaf ears. I hear your complaints. I hear your concerns. You know, give administration the time to, you know, um, internalize what you're saying, and we're gonna take the adjustments to make things better for you. Right. You know, so just letting them know that I hear your concerns. I was once there. I'm here now, and I'm looking to elevate. So you you're not talking to somebody who don't understand. You know, I let them know I'm in the trenches with you guys. Right. I'm here working with you guys. So, and had I not had self-confidence in myself, right. the way that was persecuting me and saying different things, it could have shook me, but it didn't. It was your meditation. Speak it was the meditation. meditation. It would that it really instilled that unshakable confidence. Amen. No matter if the world is coming against me, I'm going to stand on the, the things that God God. God told me to do. Yes. And later you're going to see for us and with the communication skills, you know, um, 
I was deemed aggressive because I have direct communication. I don't have side talk and I don't have the little small talk. Mm-hmm. I don't talk in codes. I don't do shots, you know, sneak disses. I don't do that. And mm-hmm. most people are intimidated by that. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Oh, she's aggressive. I'm not aggressive. If I'm talking, I have something to say. Mm-hmm. You know, I know how to talk to an individual and I also know how to talk to a group of people. Oh, right. You know, so once again, you're going to need that. I don't know what you do for a living. I don't know what type of position. It is. You may be a, a owner. You know, people may give you, like, your company a bad review. Mm-hmm. And if you're not confident in yourself, those negative reviews can, you know, internalize. Yes. And now you second-guessing yourself. Right. So you got to have, you know, unshakable uh, confidence, confidence in yourself. And also it will give you inner strength and, and, a, and a higher power of faith. It does. It does. Meditation really sets you apart from everybody. You can really see the people that understand meditation. Let me tell you. Talk meditation. to me. Meditation. <laughs> let me tell you. It's like. <laughs> just say, let me tell you. Looking at Michael Jackson. The okay. man in the Ooh, mirror. I told you. Let That's go. what it is. Meditation <laughs> is that. Oh. Get ready. You know, for the cuts and, you know what I'm saying? If you want to know who you are in Christ, mm. you got to get ready. Yeah. You really and looking have to be at ready. that man in the mirror, it'll help you. It'll become easier and easier and easier. Just like working out. You know, you gotta work out that muscle. Yes. The more reps, the easier it gets. Right. You know, if you don't if you go to the gym once a year and you're trying to do a full blown workout, you may be worked oh. out. You may be tired. Every bone in your body may be hurt. Yes. But if you got that steady working out, you know, you constantly working, even if it's yes. once a week yeah. or three Just times a week, take it, take it bit easy. By bit. bit by it. bit. And um once again, meditation is just like that you keep doing your reps and once once again we say once you learn how to meditate you can go into meditation at any time any that you want. time any anytime place. anywhere any place of any, any time of the day okay and so once again what another benefit which i love about meditation with this it will give you self-assurance it will help you to soar enable you to decide your future how you want to live mm-hmm. you know and using this idea you can rewrite the brain and replace your negative thoughts with positive uh, thoughts and behaviors you know uh it takes it takes a minute and i'm gonna tell you guys this is not easy it's gonna take work yes it does it will take work and it will take discipline nobody can give you heart Nobody can give you discipline. Nobody can make you unstoppable. Nobody can make you a sore or make you fail. You know, it's not a genetic gift. It right. is a decision. It is a it's mindset. A you know, it is it is most definitely a mindset. So nobody cannot make you unstoppable. That's right. It is a decision. Nobody gave me heart. Nobody gave me this. This is something that I decided to do and set my mind to a higher calling in Christ Jesus. Amen. I made a decision at like Romans 12 and 2 to, to have the mind of, Christ. mind of Christ. Let this mind be in me as I also was in Christ Jesus. I made a decision to let the will and the plan of God play out in my life. Now, what God decided to do with this ministry, this business, or this podcast, that's his business. Yes. But I'm going to show up every single time regardless of the results you know i have a you have to adapt a leadership mindset yes i'm gonna show up like yesterday i showed up for those girls i heard your complaints i'm gonna constantly keep showing up no matter what the results is when you stop looking at the results you get results yes i don't know if i said i don't know yeah, if you, you, yeah. when you stop looking at the results you get results you know like uh like people like on Instagram, like they all if if they post something, if they don't get a whole bunch of likes, they take it down. I'm not taking none no, down. Don't I don't care if it got one no, like. Don't take it down. No. I don't care if it got one like. I'm leaving. <laughs> somebody, somebody, somebody heard saw it. Somebody, somebody saw somebody it. Somebody, somebody got heard. It. You know, That's and, right. um, just one. That's in the Bible. Yeah, you know what? It will also be useful in getting rid of some unnecessary hard baggage. How many people got hard mm. baggages? How many people out there got some baggages? Be honest with yourself. Don't be honest with me. Be honest with yourself. At first. <laughs> I, I mean, don't be, yeah. You ain't got to be honest with me. Be honest with yourself. How many people that got heart baggages? If you got heart baggages, come on, take what we saying. Yes. You know, learn how to meditate. We giving you the benefits on a meditate. We showed you how to meditate. We even told you what meditation is. Now we trying to tell you the benefits. We really trying to grab you in so you can get the benefits of life. You know, 
and also giving you the strength to go through a trying day. Boy, y'all know we have those days. Uh, yeah, you, who don't have a trying day? And the more you do this, the more your brain will default to empowering thoughts instead of going to the negative ones. It will prevent you from taking action. And sometimes when you have a trying day, you, like one girl, she, she was, um, I don't know what they're going to do with her. But, you know, you know, she was kind of rowdy. And I kind of understand when people were raised in the project hood or whatever, stuff like that. And one girl, she kind of got belligerent and got a little aggressive. Aggressive. And so they were telling her to calm down. You know, we do understand that the morning crew work hard and get paid the least. You know, we were working on uh, different pay packages for them. But it still had to be, it's o- over our head. Mm-hmm. It still had to be approved by yes. corporate. Yes. And corporate is saying, you know, we paying them enough. And, you know, and mo- the morning crew going to always get paid the least because it's the luxury of working in the morning. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because then after the working, you still have the, the entire day to yourself. Well, with that, mm-hmm. with that being said, mm-hmm. in the mornings, if you're working, they're not looking at the fact that that's more work in the morning, even though you got the luxury in the morning. Because mm-hmm. I didn't work in places like nursing, health care, and whatever. The bulk of the work is in the morning. It is, most definitely. Yes. And, and they mostly, get paid the least. So right. that's what and the frustration was the about. the ones that come on, mm-hmm. they really relaxing because everything in the morning has been done. So that's what the corporate has to look at. It shouldn't be just, it don't have nothing to do with your morning or the timing. Mm-hmm. It's about the work, mm-hmm. the leadership, the mm-hmm. team leadership. You know what I'm saying? Right. Let's work together and let's be on the, on equal basis. And that's a fight that I think the whole world is after because it's not just in our field. It's in majority of the fields that the morning crew do get paid the least and the overnight get paid the most, you right. know, because of the inconvenience, being away from their family, you know, overnight, awake, at you're night. By, awake at night, tedious. It's very hard to stay up at night. Mm-hmm. So they do, like at our job, those girls is making um, over – uh, twenty dollars, you know, yeah. and I was just to do something, and when the morning crew was getting like fifteen, right? So you know, like a big, it's a big gap, it's and a then big the gap. evening right. is getting like seventeen fifty. So you got fifteen in the morning, seventeen fifty in the evening, and you got um twenty and more right. overnight. And so they was like, okay, but well, if you worry about the money, come join the overnight crew. Like nobody's making you work in the morning, mm-hmm. but it's the convenient for you and your family that you work in the morning. So that's one thing that we're really fighting. And that's why I was trying to tell them I got one foot in and one foot out. I hear you guys and I hear um, administration, well, not administration, corporate, because I'm part of administration. And so it's a really a big fight in between, you know what I'm saying? So I'm trying to tell them, like, I hear you, I hear them when we got to come to a common ground. You know, that's why I was telling them, like, I'm going to take all your concerns. Administration has heard your concerns. Now it's for us to take it to corporate. Right. And so corporate is going to make those decisions. They're going to make the decisions. They're going to make those decisions. But once again, having that. But see, they don't understand. They just want you to do, 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 make it happen, make it happen, make it happen. Right. You know what I'm saying? So it's really frustrating to be in a position in the middle. And so, honestly, meditation comes in. You definitely need it. Yeah, you do. You need it. You need it to, to, to also, like you say, you know their concerns. Mm-hmm. You you understand where they are coming from, mm-hmm. but at the same time, you're you right there in the middle. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's a lot of stress mm-hmm. on you. You know what I'm saying? But your meditation mm-hmm. is gonna keep you in perfect peace. Mm-hmm. That you're gonna be able to make the right decisions. And guess what, baby? And just like it, it's no different between like the White House. And then you have a speaker of the house mm-hmm. who speaks for the White House. She don't come up with thoughts on her own. She get clear directions from the White House and she give it to the people. Right. And the same thing I get, I get instructions from corporate and you see me being a speaker of the house and giving it to you guys. So it's not based on what I want to do. Right. It's based on what corporate has to say. And so I know the speaker of a house, she get up all the green because you got all the news outlets the top and, and they all asking her all these questions for us and you know why you guys are not telling us about the shooting down of the drums would we that we the people want to know we the people want to know and the speak of the house because only can give you based on what they said right you know so they're not really 
it's reasons why they're not revealing things and likewise it's reasons why you know i'm not revealing things but when corporate say it's okay then i can speak out right. on it but listen we have overwhelmed some time a little bit we're going to take a quick 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 commercial break we, we got a few more things a few more tips and benefits of meditation so we will be back with kingdom women speaking with our favorite co-host connect jones <laughs> With this liquid gold, <laughs> we be right back with Kingdom Woman speaking. Yes, Lord. Amen. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Hello, somebody. It's your boy Marlon Big Fade Favorite, and Inside the Trenches podcast is back, baby. We back. Y'all make sure y'all check us out for excellent season, and you can check us out on NewOrleansTalkNetwork.com. Y'all make sure y'all follow me at Big Fade Five Zero Four. We back at it, baby. We in the trenches. Fab, you live. New time, twelve p.m. each and every Thursday on the Walls Talk Network. Join me, that boy Fred. G Sports in the building. Coach Trevor can hit. Yeah, I'm woke. Elevate. Ball game. Yeah, dig. Yeah, dig. Here at Jones Insurance, your full service agency. Let us take care of all your insurance needs. We provide homeowners insurance, flood, rental, commercial, auto and life insurance. Don't let the unexpected tragedy destroy your family's future. Here at Jones Insurance, 7603 West Bank Expressway, Monroe, Louisiana, 772. Contact Lois at 504-348-1492. Welcome back to Kingdom Woman Speaking. This is your favorite host, Prophetess Chanel Jones, and my favorite co-host, Cornette Jones, is in the building today. And I'm telling you, if you guys haven't saw the beginning of this show, please go get it. I'm telling you, it's, yeah. it's, and once again, I'm going to keep on using the liquid gold. It's, it's a wave in here. You can feel the presence of God in here yes. with this revelation. You know, God is truly speaking through the both of us. If you allow the Holy Spirit to come into your life and come into your atmosphere, you will truly be blessed um, with these benefits of meditation. You know, now... Now, this can even help somebody who just came into Christ. It don't matter if you've been with God for 50 years, 60 years, or you just coming into God. Um, this liquid gold, you can mold it into your life. Whatever shape, whatever position that you may be in in your spiritual walk, you can mold this in to benefit you as an individual. And we will go on over um, some of the benefits of meditation. And another one of the benefits of meditation, it can help you overcome fear. Uh, relax your body and release restore your energy yes. you know uh sometimes we have to get that that reassurance um from god you to let us know that that fear is just a spirit you know because god didn't give us a spirit of fear right. you know and then meditation honestly uh, people always say you are so calm mm -hmm. and i'm calm because i meditate you know, I'm still, I'm, I'm, people realize I'm really still, I don't do a lot of moving. I don't do a lot of figuring. Um, I'm still because I control my energy. I have controlled my body. I have learned to relax. I will, I've learned to calm myself. I've calmed my mind. And so therefore I can be still, I'm not anxious. I'm not worried. You know, I'm not concerned. You know, I don't care who walks through the door. You know, I am I'm going to be me. Like, even when you don't want to see me, you see me. You may not acknowledge me, but you see me. And since I know people see me, it's nothing for me to be anxious about. Nothing right. for me to be worried about. Exactly. It's nothing for me to, oh, you got to see me. You got to see me. Or I got to be loud. Or I got to say something to catch somebody's attention. See you see me. You see me. You see me. You see me. Yes. Yes, you see me. <laughs> and so, therefore, and honestly, meditation give you that unshakable confidence. It will instill 
unshakable confidence where you yourself can be still the bible says it over a hundred times to be still be still in your bed be still on your mind be still and know that i am god stand still with your anointing what he told moses be still and i just applied what god said like it calmed my heart down like you know especially like you know going into that meeting i took some of my breathing exercises and i got calm i slowed down my speech so everybody can hear me clearly you know, so once again, that's just that's a benefit. Ooh, watch it now. Yes, I, I, I used to should we ask how to sing? Should we? Should we? Should we ask how to nervous. sing? Oh, <laughs> should yeah, we and, do and, that? Meditation uh-huh. it really has me where I'm. I'm getting out of that. Come know, on, because that was really, really like a big thing for me. Right. You know, and I'm like, and I, and I tell anybody. Oh, I like to sing. I like to sing, you know. I know. I mean, I have the talent, but I like to sing. Yeah. I mean, it's... it's. And you know what? Like you just said, that was powerful. You said um, another benefit of of meditation, your nervous system will quiet down, and you will be controlled over your senses. Yes. And that's why I was telling people I learned to be still. You know, but honestly, it's really just in the mind. Yes. It's like, you know, when you meditate, and honestly, thank you, Jesus, when you meditate, you can see yourself as this powerful conqueror. I literally see myself as a powerful queen sitting on a throne. And if you come with me... Off with his head. (laughs) 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 Yeah, I'm serious. Off with. I'm serious because you could not come in the queen presence any kind of way. You You couldn't be disrespectful, baby. She got them guards right there, and baby, when she say off with your head, it's off. You know what I'm saying? Y'all hitters don't have nothing on the queen, baby. Y'all don't have nothing. Uh, and she can. It is legal for her to do it. (laughs) (laughs) Y'all, <laughs> it's legal for her to do it. And honestly, one of the last things we're going to go over, it it assists you in developing an inner awareness and it improves your communication skills. And that's one thing I was telling you guys that, you know, meditation helped me to improve my communication skills. I believe that I have elite communication skills, even though sometimes I know I may be, uh, I'm, I may have fumbled over a word or mispronounced something. It doesn't matter. You know, I will keep going, apologize for it. And once again, having a a powerful brain, having a lot of knowledge, it means nothing if you can't communicate it, transport it. We we paint pictures with our words. We are communicators. We are transmitting the spirit of God into your heart, into your mind. Now, these are some things I'm giving you from, self-experience you know not something what i've read you know now this is what helped me right this helped me and what have helped me i'm giving to you so that it can help you you know so so what do you think uh carnet so how do you put this into practice Hmm. well first of all you have to want this you would have to have the desire yes to have this to put in practice but what helps me with my meditation Mm -hmm. it helps me far as with my physical Mm. physical my natural yes lord come on talk to another you know Mm -hmm. round you call it whole another round that's right but it actually it helps you physically um and health wise also come on because now when you're meditating and you give it to god Mm. he he will put you in a place where you know, you like I'm calm, but I'm I'm not calm. You know what I'm saying because if you like me, I have bad anxiety. Put your back up. Very bad, ba- very bad anxiety. Mm-hmm. But when I'm in the presence of God, come on now. <laughs> and when you call me and come. you say, you know, can you can you come in? Uh-huh. I, I didn't have no hesi- no 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 hesitation. Yes, okay. Lord. That's why you I know? said she said And that's why I'm like, you know, I know meditation helps me because if it was me, at one time I would have had an excuse. Mm. I would have had an excuse for it. Come on. Oh, I can't do it. I have to uh, I have to watch my grandbaby. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But in this, with meditation and practice and desiring that you want mm-hmm. this meditation, you want to be in the presence of God. Yes, Lord. He will bring you into a whole nother level. Mm-hmm. The now, victory is yours. Yes, Lord. So how do you uh, put that in practice? I, I was reading a book by 
uh, Mr. Car Carlos, and uh, he was a researcher and a professor, and he introduced uh, this powerful word to the world, and it's yet. You know, add the word yet to the back of anything. Like if, if, if Satan or somebody said you're not good enough, you just right. say yet. yet. I'm not good enough yet. Or if you can't speak uh, in crowds you, yet, you can't speak into crowds yet. And it's kind of like spiritual warfare, you know, controlling your mind, controlling your thoughts. Because if you tell yourself you're not good enough, you're not going to be good enough. Right. Period. But exactly. if you tell yourself, okay, I'm not good enough yet. You know, you're setting a tone for your life. That means you have the capability to get there. And then you gonna, it's going to be a high enough level that you say, I am good enough. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So this is, it's just, like I say, it's levels. You know, yes, so is. if you fighting yourself with at the bottom level, saying that you're not good enough, you can't speak to people, you don't have the skills yet, you don't have the mindset yet. You know, that is one powerful word. And if somebody may be, t like the Bible say, agree quickly with your, your enemy. Right. Agree quickly with your adversary. Agree quickly with Satan in your mind. If Satan say you're not good enough, okay, I'm not good enough yet. Right, not yet. Okay. <laughs> yeah, not yet. but you know, you know, like I will saying, be. I'm, 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 not, I'm, 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 not a, I'm not a singer yet. Okay. I, I'm going to get over that anxiety for singing. You know, you, I, you replace those negative thoughts, you, you know, with a positive thought. And that will be considered positive. Like, you know what? I acknowledge, like I told my, um, I acknowledge you guys. I heard what you said. It's not going on deaf ears, but let me work it out. Work it out, right. Let me work it out. Let me develop it, and, and I'll have an answer for you. And I do have an answer for it's them. A it's, a, it's, it's a protocol to everything. And also with um, meditation, you know, you if you apply these things, once you have the applied knowledge, and then you get the benefits of it. So this will most definitely help you. And once again, once you learn how to meditate, you can go into meditation at any time time so i pray that this information bless you i pray that this information reach you now i pray that the holy spirit open up your heart and your mind to receive this information and once again like i said it's liquid gold where it can mold you and god is a great uh Potter. He can break down that vessel, but he can also mold you into something great. So let this information be mold in your individual life. It don't matter where you are. You may be in your car watching this. You may be on your sofa watching this. You may be in your job watching this. But wherever you are watching it, let this mold you. Yes, because you we're know, all under, under um, instruction. Oh yes, I yes, know I am are. because all my sexiness is um. Oh, well. I can't. <laughs> Right. But you know what I'm saying? And honestly, like the gorilla said, uh, I may not be rich today, but that's why I love tomorrow. You may, may not be winning today, but you may be winning tomorrow. Oh, yeah. You know, you may not be successful today, but you can be successful tomorrow. Like she said, I love tomorrows. Yes. I love tomorrows. I'm not winning yet. Ooh, see, applied knowledge, you know yes. what I'm saying? Get the look, get yes. that wave, get that wave like yes, Lord, yes. you know what I'm saying? That's one thing I want you guys to get, you know, yet. I'm not a millionaire yet. That's the key. That's yet. me. Yeah, and I'm a I'm gonna show this video where once I become a millionaire for the second time. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a millionaire now, but I will be. You know what I'm saying? Yes, Lord, through the power and of the Holy Spirit. In the name oh, of it's, Jesus. it's it's settled and nothing or nobody can come against what I say. That's so Protected is not even funny. Amen. <laughs> yes. I don't play with nobody. Yes. <laughs> I don't play with people yes. speaking against me. Confident. Confident. Oh God! It's See what I say? Un unshakable confidence. I know you can't speak against me. You're not even allowed to speak against me. Cause guess what? The moment you speak against me, it's gonna boomerang right back in the spirit to you. Off with her oh. head. Off with his head. <laughs> it's gonna boomerang right back to you Amen. in the name of Jesus. Anything, anything evil that you wishing upon me gonna come right back in your life. So it's best for you not to even speak nothing over my life. When the guy, you know, I don't care what you know about me. Don't you speak on me. Don't speak on God anointing. You let God handle me. That's you can't right. handle me. Anything that I do that's not right, I'm sinning against God. I'm not sinning against man. So you let my father deal with me, not you. Keep your mouth off me. And be humble. <laughs> stay humble. Yeah. Amen. You yes, Lord, because humble. what God blessed me, what God bless you with, and then I, I'm telling you, I'm adding it out. I got a supervisor at my job. 
Well, when I say that girl's so jealous of me, my presence oh, get on her nerves. Girl, I'm like, well, look, so baby. you like a vex spirit and, to her. Yeah, and that's what my like, baby. I'm, she was like, well, they didn't tell me you was coming. I'm like, they don't owe you nothing. I mean, Jesus, I'm like, pray. baby, I'm like, you're the supervisor for the morning. I can't work the morning. So your your job is, is secure. I, I'm the supervisor for evening and overnight. They understand that you can't be there 24 hours. So therefore, they hire somebody else. Right. I'm like, I'm not here to replace you. I'm just here to help you. Exactly. You know, help make, the, I'm help the business. You know, it's a business decision. They didn't see if I was a good fit for you. They saw I was a good fit for the company. Right. So, and like I got told, I'm like, baby, I didn't apply for this job. I was recruited for this job. Amen. Come on, baby. That, so that. you was supposed to, you was supposed to be on. And we gonna like pray. It. We gonna like pray it. for her that she knows yeah, yeah. that you're there to assist her, right? Her, yeah. You're not there to- to replace her because right. that's what's going on in her mind. Uh-huh. She's saying, and you have so but much I, I can't help no small-minded person. I can't make you. I, I'm true. not responsible for right. your thoughts. I can know once I speak and I try to enlighten your thoughts, it's your choice on what you want to do. But, you know, we're going to end that. We're we not going to end on a, on a negative note, oh, but no, we're going to pray for her. Yes, we are. We're going to pray yes. for her and lift her up. So I want to thank everybody who's watching this show and become a millionaire with me. Okay. You know, go to a next level in life. Even if you become a, a, a hundred thousand, a thousand now. You know, mm-hmm. let's go to the next level in life. Let's lift each other up. In let's the in, the, yes, in the name of Jesus. So yes. we want to thank you guys. I want to thank you oh, no problem. for coming. Girl, I really am telling you. you look, me. yes, Lord. <laughs> Yes, I'm there when it comes down to for the rest of, of my days. We and got to I do will it. praise you for the rest of my days. Yes, and I will praise you for, for the rest of my days. Day. Woo! Yes, come on. <laughs> yes, Lord. For the, the rest of my days. days. Yes, Girl, so yes. thank you guys for watching this show, Kingdom Women Speaking. I pray that these benefits of meditation help you out. And so, you know, try it for yourself and see that what we're saying is true. You guys have a blessed day. Kingdom Women Speaking. Yes, Amen. Lord. Now. Now New Orleans has a choice. Download the New Orleans Talk Network app for your mobile device or listen at www.neworleanstalknetwork.com. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. The wait is over. This is your favorite prophetess, Prophetess Chanel Jones, and I want to introduce to you my new non-traditional podcast called Kingdom Women Speaking, where you can expect a royal discussion amongst queens. Yes, Lord. And you can find me on New Orleans Talk Network. (laughs) Tune in, world. It's your girl, Sonus Charm. And it's your girl, Spice Diva, the marketing diva. We want y'all to tune into the premiere of the Red Lip Talk podcast. Every Monday at 1 p.m. Central Time, we're going to have new topics, new guests, new businesses. Tune in to NewOrleansTalkNetwork.com. Red Lip Talk podcast. Wow. Are you looking for a home to live stream your next event? Give us a call here at Bethesda Community Event Center, the only place on a golf course that can host and broadcast live your wedding reception, your baby shower, business seminar, and any other special event. Give us a call at 504-708-9454 for more details.